Okay, so the last little bit of syntax we'll learn in this section has to do with deleting tables. We've seen how to create tables. We've seen how to describe or show their columns. We haven't seen how to put anything in those tables yet. That's coming up next in the next section. Uh, but the last thing we'll do is see how we delete them. So think to yourself for a moment, what's your guess about how you delete a table? My hint is that it's pretty similar to how we've seen how to delete something else before in MySQL. Okay, so think about that, and I'll just wait here for a second, I guess. Maybe make a coffee. All right, so the magic is drop table and then the table name. So rather than drop database, we're going to say drop table and then cats in our case. So just to prove to you that that works, let's give it a shot. Back in cloud nine, I will type drop table cats. And this is permanent, it's going to disappear. It tells us query okay. Uh, to make sure that it's actually gone, we could use a couple of different things, it's up to you. We can do show tables, oops. And it tells us empty set, there are no tables here. Whereas before when we did that, we got data. And if we try to describe cats now, we get an error because cats no longer exists. So it can't even show us the columns because it doesn't exist. So that's all there is to dropping or deleting a table. Very similar to dropping a database.